Good morning, L.B. Clark Middle School students and staff. It's Mr. Arada and Ashley reading your daily announcements today. Today is Monday, February 8th, 2022. Sorry, it's actually Tuesday. <laughs> Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. We had a couple of days off here, so we might be a little rusty. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please stay standing for the Kids at Hope Pledge. Oh, I gotta get it up, here we go. I am a kid at Hope. I am talented, smart, and capable of success. I have dreams for my future and I'll climb to reach those goals and dreams every day. All right, awesome. Let's celebrate some birthdays from a while ago here. All right, happy birthday last Thursday to Vanessa Skinner. Happy birthday last Friday to Carly Navarro. Happy birthday last Sunday to Coralie Avery and Jeremiah Denson. And happy birthday today to Raiden Bang. Mrs. Ingstrom will be around to give you a birthday treat today. Happy birthday, guys. Today's weather is going to be 24 degrees and partly cloudy. You like that weather picture? Uh, all right, uh, go ahead with lunch. Okay. Today's lunch menu is hamburgers, assorted chips, assorted fruit, and assorted veggies. All right, starting, well, this week, uh, you probably already saw them out there, student council selling the share the love uh, trinkets, items in front of the office. All items are $2.50. Proceeds are going to a few Two Rivers families who are currently experience, experiencing some homelessness. You can buy them for you, your friends, your family members, et cetera. Uh, and they will be delivered Monday, February 14th, which is Valentine's Day, during advisory. Valentine's Day Sucker Sale. The National Junior Honor Society is hosting a Valentine's Day Sucker Sale. Buy a sucker for someone you love or for your friends along with a friendly note. Dates were selling February 7th through 11th in the cafeteria during all lunch times. Delivering will be deliver all suckers on February 14th. The items we are selling, suckers for 50 cents. All right, next Monday, February 14th, will be the annual Knights of Columbus Math and Spelling Competitions. Students can talk to your math or IS teachers to talk to sign up for the competition by this Wednesday. Competitions are 30 minutes each for each, and you can do one or you can do both. Uh, and the winners advance to the higher levels and awards when you, and there are awards when you place. All right, uh, I'll do this one. Yeah. Uh, actually, go ahead on this day. Okay. On this day in 1936, NFL draft first ever. Jay Berwanger from the University of Chicago, first picked by Philadelphia Eagles. Oh, the first ever NFL draft. Kind of cool. All right. You know, we haven't had announcements in a few days, but there's no way I was missing Tuesday. No way. So I'm going to have a laughing sound effect going the entire time. Yeah? Yeah. All right, here we go, Ashley. What do you need? So this is important for you. What do you need in order to go to high school? A ladder. High school, get it? Always fair, make sure you have one. All right, why did the stadium get so hot after the game? All the fans left. And the last one is why is grass so dangerous? Because it's full of blades. Blades of grass. That is your Tummy Tickler Tuesday. Sports update. Swimming has a meet at Valdez tonight. Girls basketball, 7th and 8th grade. Girls um, teams play at Sheboygan, Farnsworth tonight. Wrestling, the first meet of wrestling seasons is next Friday at home. This Friday. Sorry, this Friday. I got to change that. Hockey. It was an excellent weekend for Manitowoc hockey. At each age level, the players came together as a team, powering through and bringing home wins. All five teams will be competing at state tournaments in March. 12 U will be hosting four home games this weekend. 14 U celebrated yet another win against their Marinette rivals. Landon Mino you know, got a goal and Miles Ekoff oh, um, got two goals. Daniel Carlin got a shutout and continues his save average of 95%. They will be going head to head against Milwaukee this weekend. Awesome job. Landon Nino and Miles DeCope, we're very proud of you guys.
Teachers on safety duty, Jim, Miss Roth, and Shrouf. Ms. Shrouf. <laughs> <laughs> and Miss Pensloff. Back, Miss Kochi and Mr. Greenkey. Front, Miss Jax and Miss Brantley. That's Miss Shrouf is the formerly known as Miss Wazak. So cha name change there. Uh, all right, student shout outs for today. Ms. Blaschka has a student shout out for Lee Webster. Super good job on getting your work completed in the last few weeks, buddy. For fifth grade, I'd like to give a shout out to Evan Brightwenland. During our salsa tasting day, Evan was the first student to offer to help me get things ready. I appreciate this his offer and willingness to help because it was kind. Also, Evan responds to my cheerful good morning every day and is always willing to chat about the Packers game. Thanks for your friendly attitude in the morning and for offering to help. I wish the Packers were playing this weekend. Ms. Schrader would like to give a shout out to Daxton Wingrove. By his kind actions, Daxton helped make students feel welcome at school. Your kind actions go a long way. Thanks for taking care of others and for always having a smile on your face, Daxton. Um, Mr. Helling would like to give a shout out to Charles Gerlowski. 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 Yep. I would like to give Charles a shout out for always displaying a positive attitude in school, keeping things in perspective, and for his great sense of humor. Awesome. And the last one is Mrs. Gleichner from Alina Sheriff Black. Alina has been working hard into integrated studies. She perseveres when challenged with difficult tasks, and she helps others when she is able to. Alina is a gifted artist and enjoys sharing her masterpieces with cl classmates and teachers. Keep up the great work, Alina. Awesome job. These are all great uh, examples of the Raider way. And speaking of the Raider way, we take care of yourself, we take care of each other, and we take care of this place at L.B. Clark. Today's right away focus is taking care of each other in the hallway. Keep your hands and feet to yourself. Help others when needed. Hold each other accountable with voice balance. <laughs> That's all we got today. I hope everyone has a great day. And today is a great day to take pride in being a Two Rivers Raider. LBC is the place to be. Get the song back up here. When you hold me in your arms so tight, you let me know.